Hello viewers, finally I have installed the latest iOS 17 update on my iPhone 13. My iPhone 13 is out of warranty, so I was very skeptical before installing these updates. As lot of iPhones are infected with green screen problem. It was previously running on iOS 16.6. .6. I have not installed the 16.6.1 .6 update because a lot of users were facing the green screen issue along with iPhone and Apple did not recognize this problem and did not give any kind of solution to those customers or users who were facing the green screen issue. Today in this video I will talk about some features that I personally feel that is handy and those features will be used on a day-to-day -day basis. The first visual changes that I noticed is in the lock screen. Now in the lock screen a lot of new things have been added. For example, these collections were previously there but some other collections such as astronomy a lot of new things have been added such as Saturn, Jupiter, Uranus. Now you can customize these things also. It was also customizable before. But this customization is a next level. Some more wallpapers are there such as there is new emoji like this. Then there is kaleidoscope. It looks like this. You can have a lot of kaleidoscope and you can set them as your preference as per your preference so these things are very cool another visual change that i have noticed is in the gallery in the gallery whenever you open any photo such as this photo and if you tap on the zoom there is an option of cropping as you can see here and if you click on the crop option it will give the cropped image before you and you can adjust the area in your uh, area in your photo and then select done and it will crop the photo this is a very handy feature and it will give a new look to your wallpapers or whatever you want to do with that image you can also select the area like this this is a very good feature and this feature has been copied from Samsung because in Samsung this feature was previously available the next feature that came handy is in the card section now you can add card and the person you are calling will see you as this you can also edit this if you want anything you can select the type of photos you want to select and name and photo sharing option you can share it with your contacts or it will ask you always whether you want to share the contact or not so this is also a very good feature according to me the next thing that is very interesting is in the typing whenever you are typing anything it will suggest you some words I am very you can see that here is a suggestion of a word very and if you click on the space it will automatically select the word I am very happy H okay that you don't have to write all the words it will suggest you some words and you can if you want to select those words you just have to tap on the space and it will automatically select the word the next feature that is very handy is in the safari if you use 
the Safari browser a lot then it will give you a very good customization option it has a private tab and unless and until you use your biometric authentication it will not open and if somebody snatches the phone with you and try to open the tab they will not be able to open it unless face id recognition is detected like this now it is my recognizing my face and it is opening as you can see so this is also a very security features one more thing uh, there is in the screen screen time as you can see let me go to screen time and see you there is one option screen distance by clicking on screen distance you can select the distance suppose uh, a child is looking at your iphone from a very close distance then it will detect the distance and give you notification that you are watching it very close but one more bad thing that i have encountered along with this ios 17 update is that the battery life the battery has been draining very fast when i updated it my battery percentage was at 89 percent and you can see that it is still 89 percent so there is no battery drop battery health is okay and as you can see here i have charged it yesterday uh, 200 percent and i have not used it much screen on time is about 3 hour and 42 minute and i am using it in 4g network so you can judge by yourself that it is not giving good battery life i think it will be solved in the next security update or something like that so these are the handy ios 17 features that i personally like if I missed something, let me know in the comment sections below. And if you have any questions regarding iPhone 13 or iOS 17, let me know in the comment sections below. Hit the like button and subscribe the channel. Thank you.